In this video, I'll be explaining the latest bundled apps and notifications seen in Graphene OS. For more information about Graphene OS, check out my other video. Here we see a list of the bundled apps in Graphene OS, starting with the App Store itself. That's what we are in now. There's also the Auditor app, which is used to test the security of installations by using another device. The default camera app can be seen here, with the standard camera features and the QR code scanner. Next, we have the Info app. This app simply explains a little bit more about Graphene OS, how to donate, and how to get in touch with the community. The release notes will explain the changes in the latest version of Graphene OS. The PDF viewer, when opening a PDF, will look like this. Note you have to press the arrows to change pages and you cannot swipe left and right. Next, looking at Vanadium, which is the default browser built on Chromium. Here it has standard browser features, including the ability for incognito tabs. It also includes password management for your login information. Graphene OS will continue to add different bundled apps as they are fit for the OS. This is one of the latest, a Crescent, which is its own app store for certain apps that have passed the test and are appropriate for its visions. For more information on a Crescent, see the link in the description below. Also recently added to Graphene OS is an approved version of Android Auto. This is working and in another video I will show you my settings in case you are wondering how to set that up. Sandbox Google Play services is also a key feature of Graphene OS allowing you to use Google notifications, the Play Store, and any app that requires these things while keeping a secure system with the sandbox version. Markup has also been added and this is a photo editor. So when in the gallery and you choose to edit a photo, it will give you the option to use this editor rather than the default editor which have a few different features as seen here. So that's a quick overview of the current bundled apps in the latest version of Graphene OS. This should apply to any of the currently supported devices. Note that the device lifetime depends on whether the manufacturer continues to provide security updates. Now looking at notifications that are showing up 
in Graphene OS, we can see a little bit more about this security. Once you have updated your version of Graphene, you will have this optimizing apps notification, which you just wait for to complete. There's also the GMS compatibility notification and other sandbox notifications. Every time Google Play has a notification, it goes through this rather than your system notifications. Sandbox Google Play notification indicates that you are running Sandbox Google Play. And then there is also the app updates and device notification updates, which are frequently shown because the device is constantly checking to see if you have the latest version of Graphene and making sure that your device has running all the security patches and is at the most secure state. So that's a quick look at Graphene OS, bundled apps and notifications. Thanks again for watching and we'll see you in the next video.